The Appleton Transit Center will be undergoing a massive renovation. I'm Claire Peterson in Appleton with those changes as White House staff and local leaders spoke here about the impacts to the community. Uh, so I just want to talk a little bit about how important this uh, project is and some of the... The new center will have affordable housing units, solar power energy, increased security and covered bus bays. $25 million in funding comes from a Department of Transportation raise grant and another $1.8 million in ARPA dollars. Valley Transit General Manager Ronald McDonald says the project will break ground in 2026 and finish in 2028. I don't anticipate service will be interrupted. Uh, we might be in a slightly different location temporarily, but we'll continue to provide the services that we do to our community. White House Senior Advisor Tom Perez says Appleton was chosen for the grant because of their comprehensive transit plan. And uh, one of the things we look for is partnership, vision, inclusion, that equity lens. I spoke with a few folks who rely on Valley Transit for transportation. While they're excited for the covered bays, they're still concerned about bus schedules. I think we need to focus on getting the buses back to where they were, and having the buses go from 5, 6 o'clock in the morning until at least 9 o'clock at night. Currently, buses stop running after 6.15 p.m. during the week and after 1.15 p.m. on Saturday. Valley Transit said they'll be reviewing that bus schedule next year as part of the Appleton Transit Development Plan. In Appleton, I'm Claire Peterson, NBC 26.